Welcome back Villa boys to another video of my match review of a tomorrow game, a FA Cup game against Chelsea. A full found on FA Cup legended video. What then? This game, Chelsea, let's hope it's an off-season team, Chelsea. Now Chelsea, Tuesday, they just play on Tuesday against Mizborough. And you know, they absolutely destroy Mizborough. Let's be honest about it. They beat them 6-1. Very, very comfortably. Very comfortably, you know, like. They lost 1-0 at Riverside. But when they're at home to Stalvin Bridge, you can tell straight away. They're much better. They're better. They're passing more quicker. And, you know, and they do have players, you know. Chelsea are doing very, very well in the cup. In the cups, you say, in the Cabo Cup. They're in the final on the Wembley. First in Liverpool. That'd be a very interesting game as well. But in the league, Chelsea are not doing great as well in the league. They're not doing very well in the league. They're like 10th in the league. Spending £1 billion. Pounds. They spend £1 billion, pounds, but they're not doing very, very well either. Like we beat Chelsea earlier on in season 2 0. 2 0 earlier on in the season. Actually, no. 1 0 win. It was 1 0 earlier on in the season. Watkins scored for us for that game as well. That was a very good goal by Ollie Watkins for that game. Now, Chelsea haven't really improved, not that much. But they still have good players to look out for. They still have good players, you know, like Enzo Fernandez, Cole Palmer could be a threat, Raheem Sterling, his experience as well, and Thiago Silva as well, one the back. They still have the experience in their Chelsea. But this game at Stalvin Bridge, it'll be a tough one. It'll be tough because, you know, and one head Chelsea, Chelsea thinking we're in the final of the Carabao Cup game. And the other head definitely they might go for it as well. They might they want to beat us. They want revenge. Like on on um September where we beat them on nil as well. And anyway, let's talk about Aston Villa. I just got saw on the news. Like it's been confirmed now. Leandro Dendonka has gone to Napoli on loan. He's gone to Napoli on loan for the rest of the season now. With Ocean to with Bob the Ocean as well. Bob with the Ocean. So then Dunker, we could say then Dunker in the summer. It depends what Napoli can do with him. So if Napoli can um, make him full time tournament or we can have then Dunker back in the summer. We don't know yet. It depends how he, he performs at Napoli. For me, it didn't really work out at Villa. It did not really work out. Thank you, then Dunker, try for the efforts. Divilage. They will have much game time as well for Villa. And um, may best luck with, with him as well. Maybe um to Napoli. Good luck with Dendonka. And now for Villa. This game tomorrow. Cup game. Chelsea. We had to stop better. You know. Past Middlesbrough. Now this is Chelsea. Different tests. The players. Emmy press conference. I watch as well. I'm very, very confident. Very optimistic. That we can beat them as well. And here my start to 11 against Chelsea. So in goal, I'll go with Emmy in goal. Back four, Cash, Konza and Torres, I think. Or Longley, I don't mind, I don't mind both or Diego or Konza. Or Diego and Longley. Left back, I'll go with... <coughs> excuse me. Lucas Digne as a left back. Or Alex Moreno, I don't mind both of them. In the midfielders, Dini left back for me. The midfielders, it could be interesting. Like, it's, I expect it's going to be Kamau and McGinn and Luis in there. And the wingers, what well, I mean, you can go with. I'll go with um, Zaliono and Diaby on the wingers. And off front, I'll go with Oli Watkins. Because the one is not to be available because he's injured. And that's any interest for Chelsea. So Chelsea, Chelsea Sonny, but he's injured at the moment. So, what my score prediction? 2 0 Villa. I think we'll be Chelsea very, very comfortably. 2 0 Villa and scorers Watkins and Zaliono. Thanks for watching. Off the Villa. Come on.